that are in the works, especially this Veterans Day. A very important one, the 17th annual Hubbard Borough Memorial Golf Tournament. The event raises money for our local VA hospital and honors the Buchanan 8. Eight fallen service members who attended Buchanan High School in Clovis. So, joining us now live, we have Austin Bach, Michael Germanuel, and Andrea Germanuel from the Hubbard Borough Memorial Golf Tournament. Just to talk about this event, and uh, thank you all for joining us bright and early this morning. Thank you for having yes, us. Good morning. Of course. And just first up, tell us a little bit about the event. We went over some details there, but um, how meaningful is this for our community? You know, it's really a special day. Uh, as you can see, we've been going for, for a number of years. And this, we've got a real patriotic town, patriotic community, so everybody really gets involved. And these, these guys from Buchanan, they're a special group of kids. And so it just makes our job easy. Not even a job, it's something we're just honored to do and a day to, to recognize and, and celebrate them. It truly is so amazing um, what those eight young people did. Now the tournament is in its 17th year. It's hard to even imagine it's been that long. How did it start? Yeah, you know, it, it was a sad day when we lost two of our closest friends. And, and the next year, uh, a group of about 20 of us just got, to de got together. Uh, you know, they were put to rest on Veterans Day, so it always worked out to be a holiday. So, you know, a bunch of us got together, just had a good time. And the next year, there's a few more of us, and we started getting some ideas and started raising some money for it. And uh, soon enough, we just got the ball rolling. Wow. You know, we talked to the Hubbard family, and they, they wanted all the money to go to the VA hospital. So now that's where we donated quite a big, quite a large amount there. Um, we have a whole rehabilitation center named after the Hubbard Borough Golf Tournament. So it's really nice. Just to see the fruition there, and go ahead, Andrea. I saw you were about to add to that. Yeah, I was just going to say the needs of the VA are so huge in the valley. Um, you know, be between Modesto all the way down to Bakersfield, we serve so many um, from from all wars. And I think I think the last stat I heard was over a thousand new members every year are coming into the VA, and our our funds are so needed there. So we will continue to uh, donate to the Veterans Hospital here. That is so cool to know you're directly addressing a huge need uh, in the Valley, and I'm sure the Buchanan 8 to know uh, that their lives inspired something that's continuously helping the community. I'm sure they would be so proud. We showed a picture of them, and maybe we could pull that graphic back up. Um, but specifically, how does the tournament really honor and make sure the lives of these uh, eight people are not forgotten in our community? You know, I think that there's such um, a day of fellowship and such a, um, a bond between the, the people that put the event on, the people that attend it every year. Uh, we have the fallen families that come out. We have friends of the fallen. Um, we have repeat golfers that have come. The, the golf tournament sells out probably two months in advance or five teams that are always trying to get in. But um, it's such a patriotic day. It's a great way to start Veterans Day. We welcome you to come out to morning ceremonies at the fort at Fort Worth. Um, but our goal is to make sure we never forget. So the momentum and the perpetuation and the new volunteers that we're bringing in every year will always keep this event going. Wow, that is a beautiful goal to have, and it is very critical to help our community as well. Uh, logistically, is the event open to the public, and how can people uh, contribute and give, maybe even if they're not in town or they see this online later and say, can we give to this? How can they do Absolutely. that? Absolutely. We have a, a Facebook, and we have a website. They can donate year-round. It's HubbardBarMemorialGolf.com. And uh, we welcome any, uh, anybody that wants to volunteer or anybody that would like to donate year-round. But I need to pop in and show off our hot live item to you. I can't help it. I just can't help it. I love this guy. This is Trooper. And he is going as one of our live auction items this year. He's <gasps> a baby. Isn't he precious? Oh, so no. Oh, no. Y'all didn't tell me there was a guest star in this oh, interview. Yes. Yeah, we have a, a baby beagle, and he is uh, papers. He's got all of his veterinarian for a year shots included in his package, and his name is Trooper. But we have a lot of great, great items that we're going to be raffling off and going silent and live with this year. Wow. Okay, so so many ways to help raise money for an amazing cause, and 
maybe you could win a new pet too. So this is a win-win <laughs> all around. Thank you three for joining us. We'll post more details on our website as well for our uh, friends watching now live to check out. And just thank you three again for all the work you do for the veterans in our community. Thank, thank you. So thank much. you. All right. Take care. And hey, let's go back in time. This